Leo, it's Elle here to do a reading for you. I know the last reading, I, I think I said Pisces a lot, so I'm going to do this quick for you. So let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Leo, when I was shuffling off camera, what I got for you was the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups. And this drama card came in like sideways. And so I clarified that. And it's because it's like you and somebody else are trying to make something work, <clears throat> trying to have reunion, trying to, yeah, trying to have reunion, maybe even trying to recreate. It's like you're open to it, but at the same time, you're a bit closed off. It's like some healing needs to happen within this connection. It's like somebody is, the drama will subside. It will go away if we can get through this. If we can live together. If you can come and see me. Oh, okay, okay so like come and see me, live together, have a successful reunion, completion of this whole situation. If we don't have another falling out, the tower card. Somebody's kind of melancholy about moving forward. It could be a cancer. One of you feels like the best thing to do is leave it alone. The best way to fix a situation is to leave it be. Because... It's like the other person, or maybe even the both of you, feel like there, it's not going to be any change. We've given this situation too many chances. Drama, drama, drama. Like maybe even four or more chances. We've just given it too many chances. Somebody might get some clarity, enlightenment that it's just not going to work. And also may get enlightenment about something that was hidden. Wow. Okay, make it up. Five of Swords. Maybe that there is or was somebody else or ulterior motive or that, um, yeah, that was like a love affair. You were never going to win or something about never going to win. Somebody is just this. Oh, this is chaos of the mind. Somebody's not able to. So somebody's like, look, we can stay in this marriage or this commitment or this relationship if you can keep it together, if you can hold it together. But somebody is um, extremely chaotic. You know, um, they don't have mental clarity or they don't have enlightenment. This is somebody here who is um, chaotic, erratic, sporadic. The Knight of Wands showing up in and out. Off and on, hot and cold, want power, is about lust. You know, just like it says, finish what you start. Somebody has a hard time doing it and they want to do the, the makeup to break up. So this just reads as if, like, okay, we can make it work, give it another chance. But if we get the same situation, same, same history, where history repeats itself, somebody's going to be completely checked out and really going to want to move on. And they're going to be completely aware that somebody, they lack the ability to change. There is no change. This is the real them. Okay? And um, somebody could be born... Between the years of 1969, 1970, 1971, 1980, 1986, 84, 1991, 1999, 2000, 2001. I don't know. Or those years could be significant. This relationship is combustible, like especially because of some feminine energy. It could be a woman or it could be same sex relationship. So you got to figure out who's the feminine energy, right? Like, it's ready to explode or somebody's ready to explode. 
And as soon as somebody does that, because this might even be like mental and emotional instability. Chaos. And it's, it comes in, in spurts or sporadic or it, it, somebody's like, uh, this, this gotta go. You gotta go. This gotta go. Somebody gotta go. I don't gotta go. Go, go, go. Like, no. Let's see. Somebody is not over something. They still need to heal. Let's see. Okay. Two cards wanted to fall out. Yeah. Friendship. Like, okay. So we, oh, so the, we made like a pact to make it work. We're saying we're going to make it work. Okay. And wow. Can't make it up. We say we're going to make it work. But somebody's just the inability to grow up to mature, young male. And it might even be somebody who's like older but acts young, has like nice things, flashy car, this, that, and the third. They can't grow up. They can't settle down. This is not a person who's settled. This is also someone who's not settled in their mind, in their heart space. The hand of destiny might step in and, you know, kind of. Do whatever it's going to do. Show out. Show up. What's the advice for Leo? Advice for Leo. Advice for Leo. Advice for Leo. Okay, Six of Pentacles. The give and take. Sometimes this could be the bad of the give and take. This could be somebody showing their emotions by way of giving you stuff, gifting you, giving you money. Or maybe this is how you want somebody to show their emotions. Give me some money. This is somebody maybe lording their power over you. They like you in this position of always begging, waiting for, just taking the, the scraps, the crumbs, the bread crumbing. They like to be in the power, in power. They don't want the power dynamic to change. This is the advice for you. I don't know if this is you doing it or the other person. Maybe even take your power back. Yeah, death card. You might need to go ahead and sever ties with this. It's like some, this is outdated. An outdated loyalty to either you or the other person. I don't know. Sever the ties with this outdated outworn loyalty it doesn't even suit you or fit you anymore it's just lack of maturity and it's maybe even bad timing lack of maturity yeah this could be the breakup of a relationship also because it, it's kind of like offset Somebody feels like they're better than or they have more than or that you should do what they say. Follow them. Follow their lead. take Let them take the lead because they have maybe more material wealth than you. More opportunity. There has been talks, maybe even gossip about somebody's um, emotional instability their delusion delusion like illusions of grandeur i don't know somebody is just not wrapped too tight eight of wands again like law of attraction and infatuation and um chaos too the eight or circles so somebody it's like cyclical thinking cyclical doing we're doing the same thing over and over again and somebody is blaming the other party. The other party is blaming the other party. I don't know if somebody begs somebody to come back. Even though they're not going to change. Eight of Wands, Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Four of Pentacles. Somebody's stuck in chaos. Somebody's stuck in a cycle also. They don't have enough. Whomever this is, who's always confused, convoluted. Always switching up, changing things. Can't stick with something. Can't stick with a job. Can't stick with going this, go, doing that. Always 
flip flopping. They're easily controlled, and and that other person in power likes that. Why? Because they can manipulate them, and they can't always, you know, have the upper hand. Trickery, deception. Somebody uses somebody past against them too. This is what I have for you, Leo. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book your own reading. Somebody used somebody past against them. Maybe somebody was like an, uh, a performer, maybe an exotic dancer. <clears throat> Didn't come from the best upbringing. Um, and somebody does this right here. Well, you know, um, I'm better than or, you know, I, I know better or I'm older than or I have more than. So you should, you know, they make statements like that. Or if it's not full on, they verbalize it. They act like that. You know, like, you know, I can give you the opportunity. I can provide this. I do this. I, you know, and you, 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 you know, it's like. Keeping somebody like a dirty little secret too or. There could be another woman here. There's another woman. Outside of the main woman. Somebody's given to two or more parties. Somebody's in need. That's why they keep coming back too. Somebody doesn't want to learn how to do for self or... Independence. We had no nines here. Somebody doesn't want to be independent. Like codependency. That's what I got. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. I'm live every Tuesday, Thursday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time doing a collective reading and answering your questions. Thank you for being here. If you want to get your questions answered, go ahead and you can uh, text it to the number below. If you want to get your questions answered or catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday. Uh, not this Thursday, but next Thursday, we will have our Halloween party. I'll come dressed in my costume. You should come dressed in yours too. Hit the Zoom link. Get your questions answered for free. Let me see you. You see me. Let's have fun. All right. This is what I have for you, Leo. Take care. Many blessings. Oh, keep in mind that um, the 10-minute readings are on sale. I'll link it below. It's $25 for 10 minutes. All right. Take care.